Number one. Number two. And number three. One, two, three, go. Hello, and welcome to Bobbing Land season number. Season number four. Hello, just everybody. Four. I know. <laughs> This is season number four of Bob and Glenn, and we are very happy that you could be here tonight. All right. All right. Um, we have um, 25 great episodes here for you this season. Kicking it off here with number one. As everybody knows, Glenn was left by Bob. Um, <laughs> um, in the middle of the, in the middle yeah, of yeah, yes, in the middle of the airport, actually. But that's not really the point. Um. The point is that we're off here in a new season, and uh, we're going to kick it off right now with an episode one called The Party. Party! I'm going to go to have a party, and then the priest is going to come and ruin it. And the hick is back. Oh, I just so ruined it. The hick is back. He is back on his ranch. We picked him up, put him back, so we'll be seeing him a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah we have a great, great season, man. Great season, man. Bunch of characters, new character, new character coming, but we're not gonna say anything about it yet. Playing drums. So um, Enjoy. let's get yeah, let's get the show rolling. <laughs> Thanks for having me. No problem, Sal. Don't make fun of my lying ways. Oh, stop your bullshit. Don't make fun of my lying way! It's not my fault that I was born with this voice! Shut the fuck up! Listen, we gotta resolve this because Glenn's gonna be here any minute. Oh man. Oh shit, I'm leaving right now. I'll leave you guys there. I got my way. Yeah, one second. Apparently, yeah, yeah. Apparently, we got an asshole on our hands. I'll call you back. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Eighty-seven days ago. Uh, Eighty-seven days. What? Eighty-seven days ago. Uh. Mm -hmm. Some days ago, I was uh, at the airport. Mm -hmm. Funny story. Funny story. I was out looking for the hick, mm -hmm. and uh, you drove away on me. Oh, oh let, let, let me explain that to you. Where did you go? Well, I stood there for about ten minutes while you drove away. I well, I didn't you. see you. I called your phone. I didn't man. see you though. I know, but uh, listen, where would you go? Well, I think you deserved everything that you got. Now where'd you go? I stayed there. Why'd you stay there? Cause okay, I'm... no, 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 no. That's not what I'm saying. Well, I'm saying you. It's where'd you go when the hit came in the car? I went picking uh Never mind. <laughs> okay, okay. Listen, if you're what? What? No, I'm gonna explain myself in two seconds after you explain you. Okay. One picking apples. Saw a tree. Man, it's the end of December when that happened. Why in the hell were you doing air? We were doing air, boy. Apple tree. We were doing air. Apple tree. Were you doing air there? Apple tree. Yeah, had what? Yeah, that's your own fault, though. Huh? Well, I think, anyway. See, I'm really getting into the Cape Breton accent right now. Think it's pretty good? Pretty, pretty well, good. Well, I've been there for 87 days. Well, that's your own fault, there. See, see, if you were with me there, uh, you would have... Yeah, but you, told right to the heck. you told me to go look for the heck. I went to look for the heck. Yeah. After I looked for the heck. That's your own pop though. Came back. She came back there when he was coming back. I then. did. No, I didn't see no. I was right behind him. Yeah, bullshit, man. <laughs> I was right behind him. I, I mean, I looked at the distance and who was there? The heck was there. Yeah, I was right that behind him. I was right behind him and then... Why well, didn't you? I slipped I on the it. ice and fell with well, all the apples. Well, that was You should have got back up then. I fell with all the apples. We should have said, fuck the apples and coming in. Yeah, well, 
I already had like a hundred apples. Oh, just, were you gonna sell them on eBay? No. You would have got rotted, rotted apples. I wouldn't sell them on eBay. You can buy everything on eBay. That's just the way it is. I was gonna make an apple pie, really. What'd you get to make them? Well, well, you could have just went to the superstore there and there. Eighty-seven. Eighty-seven days. Well, jeez, why did they say in the fridge you're pretty good, eh? If you're frozen. Yeah, what fridge? I think now this is me right now. I think that was your own fault. I apologize for it. I thought I called okay, enough call. Gabriel right asked. I apologize for it, but listen to me. So we gotta do. We gotta get back here. Listen, we got a surprise party for you. Shout out to Oh, Manners. oh yeah. yeah. Well Layden was here, as you can tell, but um you kinda scared him, so he left. The priest is coming. <laughs> well, and I think that's it. Uh how did you know I was coming back? Well, um, I overheard um, a conversation between um, um, the priest there. He was saying something. How did the priest? Because he has supersonic hearing. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Well, you know what? I'm gonna go back and find Little Lane. Okay. And I'll be right here. Yellow. Yeah, thank you, Simon. I know that sounded pretty intense out there. It was. I had a hundred apples and they fell all over the ground. <laughs> yeah, I had a hundred apples. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, totally. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm just gonna... I'll talk to you guys later. Where are you going? No offense, priest. But fuck this. I just cried. See you late. I got... I... I got... I... 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 The vibe? Everyone refers to the vibe. Well, you're still here. I guess I can just read to you. You can. Okay. Hey, you ready? The book of Nehemiah. She's my uh, sister in law. In law, in law, in law, in law. You know, so many sisters and brothers. And this is crazy. Anyways, the words of Nehemiah, the son of Hash Ah Leah, and 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 and, and it came to pass when Chris knew. It, it just came. Emphasize their summit. They, they, they looked unto him. And we're lightning, and the prisoners were not ashamed. The farmer cried, and the Lord heard him, and saved him out of all his trouble. Keep thy tongue from evil, and thy lips from speaking good.